All right. So you got me without makeup today. And uh, it's Sunday morning for me. Everyone's asleep, except for the dog. You might hear it in the background. All right. So I've been asked a few times. I had a meetup on my last live meetup. Uh, we talked about uh, due diligence, right? Uh, my COO, George, he went up there and uh, he kind of gave a quick overview of a due diligence process when you buy an apartment building. And uh, I promised everybody I would share my template, right? That thing is insane. Um, there's some modifications we've been doing to it. That's why it took me a little bit of time to get it to you guys. But I have it ready now. And I'm going to kind of just show you a few minutes, kind of the overview. I'm not an expert on it. But um, we do use it with a software. It's a project management software. Uh, the name of it is monday.com, like Monday, Tuesday, monday.com. It's a pretty awesome uh, project management software. You can use it for anything, to-do list, social media posting, just about anything you can use it. And it's pretty cool. You can coll collaborate. We don't use it to its max. We just use it for a certain few things, and I'll show it to you guys. I'll, um, I'll give you guys a template and um, I'll, I'll put a link with the uh, money.com. Um, it is a charged uh, program, but I mean, you get a free trial and, uh, but you can at least take a look at the, at the list. It's very important to do your due diligence. I mean, it's, it's really, really important to have this, uh, this list. All right. Oh, there you go. My dog. Let me share my screen here. Right, so you can use this on your browser, or you could also do it on, um, um, you know, an app on your probably your Mac or your Windows base. So this is probably not the best of you. I didn't know that was gonna pop up, but this is like mine, personal, and you can kind of choose and pick who on your team can see what. So uh, we have a lot of stuff here. I have a lot of stuff, right? You can you can have an employee offboarding template. Right, like this is just a template. Everything you got to do when you off offboard somebody, when you onboard somebody. There's a lot of cool stuff, and it integrates with a lot of other softwares. Right, it probably integrate with your CRM. So I mean, I kind of like it, just because it's kind of a quick overview. Like I could give my my assistant, you know, somebody needs me to do something, they'll just add me to it, or uh, like right here on the owner, like this is mine. This some items that I'm working on. So I kind of track it. And like I said, this is super simple, like super simple. There's some really, really cool stuff. You can search for templates. It's about anything you can find. Um, like here's all our, some of our deals that we have going on, right? Super cool. Like we have like $67 million worth of LOIs out right now. Insane. Um, mobile home park. Here's our team. So if I need something for somebody to do, I can I can always tag them, do some stuff, you know. I give somebody some task. Anyways, enough of that. Enough about that. Let's go to the uh, template. Where's that at? All right, let's go. Where is this thing? All right, where are we? Here we go. So here's a template. As soon as this loads up. All right. So you have like phase one, the pre-contract right? You got the pre-contract phase. Then you have your acquisition team, right? The analysis. And when you click here on the expand, the subtitles, uh, sub, uh, sub item, sorry, you click on it and it has other items to do, right? Like this is our items that we do. Okay. And then you can, you can give somebody ownership of that, right? So everybody is on the same page. And if they've, if they checked off, like, um, Four of these on 
you know, four of these done, there's eight sections here. The progress will go to 50%. Then you can put a deadline. Um, create letter of LOI within 48 hours. And there's also, you know, some notes you can put on here, right? Here's some notes, right? Like we want a 45 day due diligence period, a 30 day due diligence extension, a 45 day close, something like that, right? Um, some form or 45, 45, 30, or 45, 30, 45. I'm not gonna go through this whole damn thing because this is insane. This is just during, not even the contract yet. We should change this color, the yellow is kind of hard to read. Okay, then you have construction management. Here's a few things you do. You know, the CEO, the, you know, whoever you know, decides uh, high level, decides on project decision. At some point, like, hey, are we gonna kill it? We're gonna buy it. What are we gonna do with this thing? We're gonna sell it, we're gonna wholesale it. Then you have your phase two, which is contracted due diligence, contract to due diligence, right? So here's everything that we have to do. Contract, contract due diligence, sorry. So whatever our contract has, you know, we got to get the contract reviewed by attorneys, make sure everything that we have is in there. We negotiate with the seller as far as, um, you know, what documents we want. Like we put everything in our contract, like, hey, let's, uh, I want like everything. I want your DNA, your social, your mother's, you know, maiden name. I mean, not that detailed, right? But we put everything we can in there because most of them would come back and be like, hey, I'm not going to give you half of this stuff. But then that's okay. Then we negotiate on some of the items, but there's some key items that we need. Some key items, right? Like we need the financials. I mean, we can't, you know, it's almost hard to get a loan without the financials. So there's some uh, different, some items that you definitely need to have. Um, then you have like a bridge loan application. If you're doing a bridge loan, right? Or if you're doing a regular loan, you got the loan sponsor, you got to submit some, you know, paperwork. Got to get started right away. Got to get started with the insurance. You have the construction management team. You have the asset management team. You have the operations team, right? I mean, investor relations, got to start raising some capital. And then again, right, what are we doing? What's the decision going to be made? You got phase three, closing, the closing phase. Um, the acquisition team helps you to, you know, close a project. Any kind of documents are missing because you're always going to be missing some documents or the lender's going to be like, hey, I need the insurance, any insurance claims, you know, from in this building. So you got to go back to the insurance company, to the owner and be like, Hey, you have any claims on this building in the last five years? There's some more stuff with the construction management, property management team that you got to get together with them and have a conversation with them as well about what your plan is, what they recommend for the property, asset management team, open bank accounts, work with title companies, review settlement statements, lenders. I mean, this takes a minute, right? And they still have your investor relations and your legal team, you have your application for your loan. We just put bridge loan here, but it can be any loan. And then you go from closing to stabilizing 18 months, right? This is for a uh, value add apartment building. And you start seeing overseeing construction, you know, property walkthroughs, things like that. So it just keeps going, right? Um, and then 18 months was the refinance. This is if you're doing a value add, right? I mean, if you have a three-year exit, well, it'll be a little bit different, but I'm just showing, I'm sharing with you our, um, our value add uh, template. So we've done some modifications to it. And, um, but this is our template and I'm gonna share it with you guys. I'll put a link at the, at the link of the video or um, this might be an opt-in form. I'm not sure how we're gonna, I'm gonna do this. I just kind of winged it like, hey, let's just do it now because everybody's sleeping in my house. Nobody's going to bother me. And uh, I'll, put, I'll put this out. I don't know if you can download it on Excel. You might be able to, but I would do it on monday.com. I'm going to put a link at the bottom so you can uh, you can check it. And if you have, uh, if you need something, um, um, if you need something to manage any kind of projects, right? You have rehabs or to do a list, it's, it's, it's a good, it's a good uh, project management. So if you use it right, and there's a lot of tutorials, I haven't even had a chance to look at them. Hopefully this helps you guys. Um, and there it is, like I promised, this is the our apartment project template. And enjoy. <laughs>